Here we have a question on marking the probability onto a number scale. If you've not attempted this question as yet, do pause the video and try it now. Okay, so putting on a, uh, a mark on a number scale, these sort of questions are very common to have an answer that is zero and an answer that is one. And don't try to be too pedantic or too um, argumentative about whether it's zero or one or just near it it's probably best just to do the sensible thing. So probably the boy will be a height, grow to a height of five meters. Five meters, if you take roughly a meter to be three feet, it's actually more than three feet, but that's 15 feet tall. Um, as far as I'm aware, nobody's growing taller than eight foot 11 and three quarters. So there is a zero probability of somebody, a boy being five meters tall. Uh, the probability that the sun will rise tomorrow um, be careful with that. Some people misread this as the probability is going to be sunny tomorrow, but the sun will rise every day. So that's a probability of one. The sun comes up in the east and sets in the west. So it's going to rise every day. And uh, therefore, a probability of one. On a probability scale here, mark the probability you get a, a six on a fair dice. So six on a fair dice is one out of six chances. Quite tricky to know where one sixth is, but if we mark on. Um, there's a half. A halfway between there and there is a quarter, and a halfway between a quarter and zero is an eighth. So a sixth so it should be somewhere in between there. Um, I would go around about here. Now, when they mark this, they'll have a, an overlay that they, they lie over the top of this, and that there'll be a region marked on here where you're allowed to put your cross. I haven't actually seen the region for this, but I would have thought it is relatively generous. So it should be somewhere in this region here. So you, but you do have to be reasonably accurate.